So I've been watching Jamie's Food Revolution in LA. Good program, I can recommend if you can somehow manage to catch up on it. Check it out, it was quite interesting and um, you know I feel for the guy trying to you know push his food ideas into into the American system and um, kudos to him for that. But Jamie, let me explain what my dilemma is here. It's this. We've got one of them Spanish exchange students here at the moment. She's a 12 year old girl, 12 year old girl and they get sent out to Ireland to pick up a bit of English and you know be exposed to a slightly different culture. And man, this is tragic. This girl somehow seems to be completely, completely unused, unexposed to anything that looks remotely like anything recognizable from an animal or a plant. I'm not kidding you. This person will turn her nose up at anything that can be recognized. So my conjecture at this stage is that this girl has been exposed all her life to nothing other than chicken nuggets, burgers and other crap like that. This is Jamie. This is pearls before swine. It's a complete waste of effort on my part. Well, of course it isn't, because I've got a wife and daughter who love this stuff. Thanks be to Jesus. But in this particular case, it's a complete waste of effort, a complete waste of time. Look at this. That chicken was stuffed with half an onion, some bits of fresh uh, ginger, some garlic cloves and uh, rubbed in with some curry powder just to give it a bit of flavor on the crust on the on the lovely skin and here um, you're not going to be able to see this I don't think because I'm going to have to tilt this damn I'm going to pick up the camera because I want you to see this here we have the parboiled vegetables that are going to be roasted and in the the juice that I use for the pie boiling, I put some herbs out of the garden and all that good stuff. And of course, that's going to be the basis for my gravy later on. And I know my wife and kid are going to lap this up and I'm going to like it. But this girl is just going to look at it with disgust and she's not going to touch the stuff. And I'm thinking, what can I do? Jamie, help me out here. What can I do? Because it's hard to communicate with her. Her English isn't that great and she's a guest in our house so I can't sort of you know push it too much on her. She's gonna eat what she's gonna eat and what she's not gonna touch she's not gonna touch so there's not much I can do about that. She, like I said she's a guest I can't push it and tricks such as arranging the vegetables in a smiley face on the plate uh, she's 12 years old that's not going to work anymore and obviously this girl is not as open-minded to the food revolution, to your ideas, as the people that I saw in your documentary are. So I'm at a loss, Jamie. Help me out. What can I do? Please, have you any idea? Because I'd hate to think I'm definitely not, I'm definitely not going to feed this girl on pizzas and chicken nuggets and other such crap for three weeks. That ain't gonna happen. But I would like to think that I might be able to send her home in three weeks' time, not looking like an anorexic. So, any ideas? Please help me out, brother. 